Hello ladies and gentlemen, Cody Salam here. In this video I wanted uh, to discuss a few things and one of them was why I wasn't uploading yesterday. And it was mainly because I was recording some uh, Call of Duty and the file ended up corrupting because my recording equipment ended up crashing. So I didn't upload that day but today I'm planning on double uploading. One is going to be a vlog and the other is this video. But besides that, I'm actually going to get into the video. So I wanted to uh, discuss about a thing that happened to me and a couple of my friends a couple months ago. It was uh, when the whole thing going down about the two people escaping New York prison that were murderers and how one ended up getting killed and the other was arrested. Um, we were actually hanging out down at Joey's place because he ended up uh, spraining his ankle actually and he was on crutches so how that happened was we were walking and he jumped off a bridge onto like a little hill and rolled his ankle and i actually still find that pretty hilarious but we ended up making fun of him a little bit it was nothing serious it's just like picking on him calling him a uh, crippled unicorn so whenever i see him sometimes i call him that and i hope he actually still remembers that if not uh then he will have no clue why we call him Cripple Unicorn, I guess. But we were hanging out, and we were playing some uh, Naruto Ultimate Ninja Storm 3. And we were having fun, but after a while, we got bored. So Justin came down and was like, do you guys want to go hang out? So we ended up leaving at like 10 p.m.-ish before curfew. And we started walking down the train tracks leading over to Heart Rock, which was an area where people usually go to swim. So we we're going there and halfway we heard a noise. So we checked out the train cart that was abandoned. No one was there. There was nothing. And of course our friend Lincoln ended up throwing a rock in there thinking that was going to do something. Of course it doesn't besides make loud noises. But after that we started trotting down the, the train cart area again. So we kept checking. There was nothing. So we ended up uh, giving up on that. So we started going further down the train uh, tracks. And when we get to the pathway that leads into Heart Rock, that was supposedly people say it's a really haunted area, but all we heard was just steps and like other stuff. So we thought it was animals. And halfway into the trail, we hear three gunshots. So our first reaction is to turn around and book it. So me and Justin's booking it. We're in front. Lincoln's somewhere in the middle. And all we like see slash hear is people. Well, not people. It's just Joey leaping so we turn and look and all you see is one guy leaping on um, one leg halfway down the tracks catching up to us somehow so he's leaping for his life and that's how we ended up getting the whole nickname as cripple unicorn because when he was leaping he looked like a horse so we get out of the train tracks and where they live it was exactly right beside it so we, we kept on uh running and we entered through the back door so we go in and after a while of like letting that sink in and us settling down we started laughing and I was like hey uh, Joey did you actually notice how you were leaping he's like no and I was like you honestly look like a unicorn so we started laughing and after that I showed him the whole uh, people escaping the prison so they ended up thinking it was that the whole entire time just to find out that it was like nothing pretty much it was just people shooting a gun normally so we had nothing to freak out over and to this day I find it hysterical and I probably will never like go through train track at night ever again and if you enjoyed the video please leave a like comment and subscribe and every like that you give you get one free cup of grape juice and have a wonderful morning or night